Spirit and born as a sinless. Right? Mm -hmm. yeah. Now, for anyone, so in Islam we believe no one is dying for no one. No, no, no. Right? So therefore, when Adam eaten the fruits, right? He make a mistake, right? And it's Quran tell us say he done it out of forgetfulness. But because of that, every children of Adam will not be a sinner, and therefore no one is dying for no one. So now now <laughs> Jesus' mission was believe in one God and believe him in messenger that he was sent to children of Israel. Look, Jesus didn't come for you, not for me. Because he came for children of Israel. Me and you, you we both are not from children of Israel. But now Muhammad, peace be upon him, Allah sent for the for rest of the world. Because why? He was the last and final messenger. Now, why Muhammad, peace be upon him, is defending Jesus so much? Why is making Jesus status higher? Why is saying he is the mightiest messenger of God? Muhammad, peace be upon him, said, Allah communicated him, if you do not believe in Jesus, Moses, and Abraham as a messenger of God, then you are not a Muslim. Can you imagine? Hmm. If any Muslim say that I don't believe in Jesus, he is not Muslim anymore. This is a shocking truth that Christian doesn't know. Now, I can see the belief you hold is a Muslim belief, but you label as a Christian. My brother, I don't know what to say to you. I'm shocked, honestly. I am shocked, my brother. I'm shocked. <laughs> Do you know what? You really got me. <laughs> no, I'm shocked. You know what? You are a Muslim inside. You label yourself a Christian. Don't <laughs> you don't know. That was shocked me. Now, if you believe the, you already believe in the concept of God, yes, concept sir. of Islam. You believe the true nature of Jesus. Now, if you tell, look, I believe all these things. Every Muslim will say one thing to you. You are a Muslim in terms of your belief. Now, if you believe that, and Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa is the last and final messenger, he said, among the people of the books, Jews and Christian, whoever hear about me, learn about me, know about me, and yet reject me, they will suffer the punishment. Not going, following the path, because Allah, chosen a path for him for the final path which is five daily prayers given you need to give zakat which is the charity 2.5 percent of your excessive wealth you need to fast in the month of ramadan just like jesus fasted you know even jesus given zakat in the mention in the quran and jesus worship allah alone without giving the share of worship to anyone else now this is the message of Jesus, exactly the same message given by Muhammad, same message given by Noah, same message given by Abraham, same message given by Adam, same message by Isaiah, all of them. That's, like, that's, look. that's why I believe it's the message of God. Like, so now Muhammad is a messenger of God, my brother. Now you know he is for us. Allah said, Wa ma illa linnas. Allah said, Muhammad, peace be upon him, as a witness for mankind. When I say witness, what is the witness? Means he send you message, he given you, you know about him. And he know you deep down, he's a messenger of Allah. Allah commissioned him for me and you to save us from the, from the severity of the day of judgment, where everybody will be accountable and everyone will be, everyone will be judged for their sin and the reward, right? So you see, now you believe in that concept, now, we need to show the gratitude to Allah, right? How do we do that? By following Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam. No, by 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 doing good. No, I but, think you understand me. By doing good to whoever comes your way, whatever Muslim, Christian, Hindu, right? You don't need to say this is my religion. Mm -hmm. It's people that came across you in life, yeah. they ask, what are you? Are you a Christian or Muslim? Is until they do that, right? You will, you will not combat anybody by saying something. It's by your action, Correct. by your attitude. I I agree with what you have said, yes. but I will add something. I will not remove something. 
I will add something. Yeah. Allah saying, said in the Quran, وَتَعَوَنُوا عَلَى الْبِرِّ وَالتَّقْوَى Help one another in goodness. But do not help one another in transgression. Right? Look, look at the message Allah giving us the Quran. But this is the right between me and you. I should expect that you treat me better. And you should expect I treat you better. That's between relationship between me and you. But when it comes to the relationship with God, you cannot the same similar level of exchange with God. But God's rights is different. God's right is, he tells us, now, God's no, right, no. God's right will be only... You see one thing you should know, deep down, is before Jesus Christ, the world is assisting, right? Are you saying now that before Jesus Christ, all those people that existed, mm -hmm. will perish? Mm -hmm. Now, after Jesus Christ, Muhammad came. Yes. Are you saying now that after Jesus Christ, before Muhammad came, everybody will perish? No. No, I'm not saying that. No, no, I'm not no. saying that. What I'm trying to point to is that yeah. uh, I'm trying to point to humanitarianism. You can take any religion, right? But you should be good to other No, I, that's what I said. Right? I agree, my brother. I no. agree on when come to behavior with know. human being. There are certain goodness that God has placed this goodness within us. But when I'm talking the rights of God, I'm not talking about rights of human I, I, being. I believe in God, right? But I don't take any... I'm Christian by birth. But yeah. No, but you're Christian by birth. Yeah, I don't by, take any... But living, any religion, you believe... It's man-made. It's man-made. Man well, and anybody can say anything to me. I just listen and But do you think religion is man-made? No. If it is not man-made, you will not see pastors exploiting the people in the church you will not see imam exploiting the people in the mosque it's man-made they are fighting for their own pocket deep in the look around you you see a lot of imam and you'll be disappointed you see a lot of pastors will be disappointed so i don't follow them it's man-made okay they, they are saying things to put something in their pocket okay so so let's say 50% of the people are dodgy, 50% also sincerely following. So you don't want to follow those who are troublemaker. Look, there are, there are imams, there are, uh, 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 there are good scholars that are following that. Right, right. Now, so these people are sincere. The distinguish between these two people, that one, people are, one group is sincere, another group is not sincere, right? So as a human being, don't look into those non-sincere people, but follow, look, Allah sent, you know why Allah sent messenger? You know why? So that you don't follow this church and pastor and all of these things. Why? You follow the correct people. Look, these people are the best people lived on the planet, all the messenger of God. And they has been approved by who? God himself, God approved them. Why God sent a messenger, a guide, a teacher, why? So that you don't follow this pastor, this church. So show us the guideline. Correct, my brother. Now, that's why I say, if you follow a particular people, you will not be a Muslim. But if you follow Islam and the Quran, that, yes, definitely. It's English? Yeah. Why don't you become a Muslim now? Uh, no, uh, let me study, believe me. One thing, one thing for sure, Read chapter 3 I will, I will do and chapter 19, you will see. You will see me here personally. Let, let me give it Thank to you. you. The, look after yourself. It was nice, pleasant talking to you. Thank you. Bye-bye. I, I have a brilliant conversation with uh, the, this man. And he is initially was not interested. But uh, when he heard about Islam and the concept of Islam, he actually a Muslim inside by belief. But he labeled himself as a Christian. So Alhamdulillah, I have explained to him. Uh, I hope that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala guide him and guide him to the truth. Uh, please make dua for this man. Jazakallah uh, khair. Barakallah. As-salamu alaykum.